All right, y'all, you know what I'm saying? What is the deal? Back with another freaking video, y'all, man. I got, it's kind of blurry. I got my boy T behind me, man. Right now, we headed to a freaking tire shop. I need some hair on my tire. So we're gonna do his video. I don't know what the hell we gonna do with today's video, but man. We gonna show y'all me getting this hair. I gotta get my car. My car's been parked for like, Five days I haven't went in the drive. I just been cooling and chilling, so we got to get this car looking back how it normally supposed to be. And we're gonna thug it off. We're gonna get out here and do something, man. Do something productive for today's video, y'all. I ain't gonna lie, the last video with the start, no, it's not the last video. The video before that, man, the support was so crazy. We got like damn near 1.2K. So thank y'all for everybody that's been coming to the channel and subscribing. If you watch my videos and you haven't been subscribed yet, go down and subscribe, man. <laughs> The red button, you know what I'm saying? Make that little like button, make that boy blue. Smash the like button right now. I really don't ask y'all too much, but man, I'm gonna start asking y'all a little bit, you know what I'm saying? But shit, man. Yo, let me turn on that new Doug, but y'all, what is the deal, man? We got a brand new video, man. We gonna tell y'all how it's getting dark. We gonna let y'all know how this car has did to me, man. I had this car for a year on june 11th it'll be a year since i bought the chrysler 300c man the car has came so far so long but man i'm gonna tap in when we get to the car wash and get a little bit more settled now your boy then got to the, the famous that's me <laughs> hey boy they got to the car wash man and i did i had to clean the inside of my car my car was so filthy man don't worry about the outside but if y'all see me in person and you wear extra large, say something. You're going to have this free eBay shirt, man. I had to clean the whole inside. Now it's time to do the outside of the car, wash the outside of the car, man. And I'm ready to let y'all know how this whole journey has just been, man. Me with this damn Chrysler 300C. But this whole journey has been a pain and a blessing in the skies, man. I got so many new subscribers, man. And it's just crazy how far this car had maybe came. I was so worried about getting this car. I did not know if you guys were gonna like it, but inside is clean, man. We're gonna do the full car detail, man. Get the car looking right. The car was clean. Michigan weather's hot as hell out. Yes, man. We about to get into this, man. I am so excited. It's been a year, man. It's been a whole year with the Chrysler 300C, man. After all the breakdowns and I ain't gonna prolong it. Let me get this car clean. We're gonna jump right into this video. All right, gang. Just like I told y'all, man. Inside and outside of the 300C, it's clean, man. Whew. Michigan heat for it. God, we wet, man. Sheesh, man. But the car. It always look good. Like, if I take my time and wash the car, it always look good. I ain't gonna cap. But, man, I got this chemical guy spray to, like, to wax the car. I'm gonna put this on there and see how it do. Truck is, you know what I'm saying? Don't get on your boy. But, man, this look good, dog. All right, man. I did wax the car with the chemical guy spray. But, anyways, whoo! This boy looks so good, it's shiny, you know. Y'all can't really tell how shiny it is because it's, it's behind this little building, but I'm gonna go park it right there in the sunlight so y'all can see. But when I clean her up like this, man, I ain't gonna lie, she look beautiful, dog. So I'm about to put the tire shine on here. We're gonna go over there, sit in the car. You know what I'm saying? We're just gonna go over everything that we have been through with this car, man. How much money I have spent on this, man. It's just telling you if you should buy one or not, man. It's a, it's a good car. So, if you want to know that, man, these cars are legendary to me, man. Ooh, oh, this boy, Glass House, gang. Shout out to my boy, Jew, got me saying Glass House. This boy look crazy, man. Oh, man, I ain't gonna lie. This boy look, they, they looking. Shit. This boy look amazing, man. Shout out to the chemical guys, man. That boy looking right. Yeah, sir. Man, the freaking the camera don't even do no justice, man. In person, real life, here right now in this moment. Whew. Man. Y'all see that. Y'all y'all see that. Y'all see that light you from, you know what I'm saying? The you know what I'm saying? Light up there. Shining down on the holy grill gang. But I'm afraid to do, man. I know I've probably been prolonging this, but I'm afraid to do, gang. We get into this video right here, right now. Let's get into 300. So, gang, first thing first, the biggest thing you see on this car 
to make this stand off from how it looked. Now I'm gonna put pictures on here to show y'all, but the biggest step that made this just car different from the regular old granddaddy 5.7, man, was the SRT wheels, man. The SRT wheels, ooh, my boy, SRT, my on the screen, man. He got me in this, uh, he got me in on, man. Them his old wheels, if y'all don't know, he got Hellcat rims on his car now, but the biggest fix on this car was wheels did just such a such a outstanding look number two the freaking chrome delete with the wicker bill and everything man this car just came so freaking far and this is just gonna keep getting better and better i take so much pride in my car shout out to the sponsor man pack a punch performance always look out for me anytime i need to swing through there his Instagram on the screen right now, pack a punch performance, man. But this car has came so long. If y'all don't know, all that was chrome, though. All that was chrome. I'm going to have, like, pictures on the screen to try to show y'all in. Look how beautiful the wheels is, man. God damn. What do I got else do I got to show y'all? Then the, you come to the front, you look at the splitter and the splitter rod. You don't see a lot of Chrysler 300 first gens with splitter and splitter rods. I, mean, I ain't going to cap. You just don't. It just be on like the newer cars and stuff like that. They really don't make them for these older cars, but you can get like a universal one like I did off of eBay. This has been a journey, man. Y'all literally used to horse me in the comments and say, eBay, get a chrome with me, get a chrome with me, get a chrome with me. Do this, do this, do this. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I, uh, at that point at that point in my life, I was kind of, I ain't gonna say I was happy, but I was content for a while because I just spent a lot of money on the car and I wasn't really too... <sighs> I wasn't really too um, pressed to spend a lot of more money into it, like get the wheels and stuff done. But this is a car build shop, like I always tell y'all. So everything's gonna happen day by day, step by step, man. And this has been a one year journey, man. Hopefully next year we can get something a little bit newer and new and just a little bit faster, man. But while everybody has been coming to the channel, man, I am greatly appreciate it, man. It's been crazy. A lot of y'all know when I first got this car, if you've seen the video, right here on the screen, the, the day I bought the car, all right here, I didn't know what I really wanted, man. I wanted to go for a Charger first gen. I knew I wanted Mopar on the jump. I didn't want no Chevy, no nothing like that. So I already had my mind made up. And if you don't know, damn near the best car on YouTube, it's a Mopar, man. I don't care what year it is, Mopars do so good. So I knew what I wanted. And man, I know my budget. I really wanted an SRT8. I couldn't find one for a good deal with low miles and in good condition, man. It was so many SRTs that was just trashed and just wasn't just wasn't in, in, in the best condition for the price. You know what I'm saying? The sun was over budget. Because these cars, SRT still going for. 12 to 15 K and that, that's crazy. But if y'all don't know, I paid 5,000 for this car. First time out there buying the car, didn't know how to sign the title. And that cost me a thousand bucks. So quick rundown on that man. I, the guy who bought the car, never put the car in his name. He only owned the car on title, which means he signed the title, but never went to the DMV. So me not knowing how that worked, I had to get some do legal documents taken care of. I had to get a whole bunch of BS. So I paid a thousand dollars at Secretary State. I'm gonna put all that footage in right here, man. I spent a lot of money just getting this car in my name. I spent the five K on the car. Then I spent a thousand like a couple of days later, man. It just was a long hassle. Put a lot of money out my ass, literally. And hey, I ain't gonna lie. I had to go deep up in there. I just don't want y'all thinking I'm just trying to talk about it that we almost at 4k subscribers. This it's just journey has just been amazing, man. I have so many supporters on my social media, on my Snapchat, my Instagram, you know what I'm saying? In the comments, man, I am just truly blessed. This is a dream come true now. If y'all don't know, uh, y'all probably just don't know. I don't know why I said that, but man, I was kidding to have a gaming channel. I was so in fact, it was like FaZe Clan and just being a YouTuber. I'm a shy person, but I like the spotlight, man. So when I get in my zone, I like being on spotlight. And who would have knew me buying that car for 5K would have turned into this? I know it might not be much to y'all, but man, this is this is a lot to me, man. I take a lot of pride enjoying this car. Ups and downs, me breaking the transmission, breaking the diff, man. Me sliding, tearing the front suspension up, man. It's just. 
it's been a lot of time, effort, and money, and 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 uh, just a lot of hurdles to jump, man. Cause this has not been easy, man. I ain't gonna lie, it's been a couple times I spent my last on this car, cause just stuff breaks and i ain't gonna lie i ain't the richest guy i'm very humble if you watch the videos man and it's been times i had to put all my stuff in this car you got to take the leap of faith like tall guys say man and you got to want to better yourself man it, it, it's just so much i can just talk about and it, it, it's just kind of amazing i have this car man it's only a five seven y'all might think but when i was growing up gang i always liked it fast cars my dad had nice cars fast cars with Rams and stuff. So I always grew up in the car scene, car shows and stuff. So it was just, wouldn't be right not to have a nice looking car, man. And when I bought this, man, it's, 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 it's a gamble. I probably had probably about 500 maybe subscribers or so, maybe a thousand. If that, before I had the car. I went out and spent all that money. When I spent my whole, everything I collected on this car, was people saying, man, now you broke and, what happens if YouTube don't work? Cause my whole thing was getting the car for YouTube. The whole plan, none else, none more. People was telling me like, what happens if YouTube don't work? And I was like, man, it's gonna work. We gonna get somewhere. If not, I try. All you can do in life is try to succeed. If it, you go down and not do something good, man, don't you try. There's so many people in the world that want to do something, but they so scared of trying to do something, man. All I gotta say is, go out there, try your best, and see what happens. I ain't gonna lie, we we damn near in the cabin, but when I got the car, I knew the radio had to be changed. Now I got the, the good old Pioneer sound system there. I think it got Boston, Boston Audio sound system, so it ain't gonna lie, it, it don't sound too much crazy, but it sound good from uh from just what's in there. Y'all seen me add the stars. They not on right now, but so like I said earlier in the video, man, I got an extra large eBay shot. If you want to DM me, man, or see me in traffic, come get it. Since my mom hasn't been in the best help, so all my attention for this last past month has been on her and taking care of her and making sure she is fully functioning and just making sure she's okay. So I haven't been on YouTube too much. I apologize about that. But it's more stuff important, man. When something goes wrong with family, you have to attend to it, man. I didn't want to leave y'all for that long, but it just happened like that. But anyways, y'all, we're about to get inside this car. Get up under this AC. Let your boy catch this breath because it's hot. I didn't I didn't did this car all the way up. So yeah, boy, a second. Experience nigga with me speed up. You know it hits. I can't even cap, I got no sense. Talk I'm full of shit. This whole year with the car has been a blast. I have met a lot of you my supporters out i have uh got the car tow y'all remember that my mom did cuss the whole tow driver out my mom be on that you get what i'm saying receipt yep what's matter receipt receipt Oh yeah. Did you just see us in our pants? I still appreciate every seat car release any car there. Well you just see me in a thing. Like how the fuck will I be able to take a fucking car? And we just paid the money yeah, to get the car, bro. They just that's told you. That's just our rules, you know. Uh, y'all just y'all just do too much. Y'all just do too fucking hey, much. My job. Okay, you get out, right. bro. Do your fucking job. I just did my job. Have a nice on that, you get what I'm saying? So it, it just went through a lot, man. Getting the car towed. Me thinking I blew the motor. Me thinking I had a head gasket leak. The whole freaking antifreeze and, and radiator bust, bust, all that stuff, man. It's it just insane, man. I have spent a lot of money into this car, man. Hopefully one day it's gonna pay out through you guys, man. My biggest support system, you know. We gotta have a name for y'all, man. I feel like we should come up with names. So in the comments, I want to name y'all, man. You know how everybody got like, uh, whatever people they name, they subscribe, man. Somebody should have shot the squad, but I don't know. Let me know if y'all like shot the squad, man. But if you haven't left a like on this video yet, go down there, smash the likes button, man. Let's get a hundred likes on this video, man. I know we can do it. So I think I bought the car with like 67,000 miles. Now, boys, at 70. 
12,000 miles. So, man, if my math is right, we put about 12,000 miles on this car within a year, man. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? I just had to look at that math. <laughs> One point, man. Y'all probably saying that like, that's 10,000 miles. I'm sorry, man. I bought the car with 66,000 miles, and now we have 78,000, man. So it's been about 12,000 miles. The car has 78,997, man. We damn near at 79,000 flat. And this car has been very dependable. I ain't gonna lie, I didn't been through some, some, some crazy high-speed chases and big SRT. So, you know, I'm just playing. I do not run for police, man. Do not run for police. It's not a good thing. But all the pulled over videos, man, me getting pulled over. And all the nice cops, all the cool cops, all the dickheads. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's just crazy, man. I just wanted to know. I, I'm so appreciative of, of just even having this chance of this. If I don't make it on YouTube, man, I know I had a good run. And it's, it's been a nice journey, man. But we ain't gonna think about that, man. We gonna, everybody gonna, we gonna lift each other, man. We gonna see what this takes, man. Hopefully this takes me a nice place in life, man. Cause, cause uh, it's something I'm really passionate. I'm really passionate being a YouTuber. I've wanted to do this for, for long, man. It, it, it's, it's just, it's truly a blessing. It's a blessing and it's not even in the sky. And you know what's so crazy? When I meet y'all out in public and y'all say something to me, man, it, it, it just feels, crazy because it's like you know me you know what i'm saying like at the end of the day i feel like i'm nobody to y'all y'all might look up to me or think i'm this think i'm that man i feel like i'm nobody man so for somebody to actually know who i am and just shows that you should trust the process and actually i see myself getting somewhere man because when i first started off nobody knew me man and it's just insane i go out in public me and t go out we see three four people and it's just amazing. Without further ado, we're probably going to turn this camera on tomorrow. Y'all have seen me glass the whole car. Y'all have seen me glass it and do everything to it. Tomorrow, your boy got to get that haircut. Look at that. Oh, my God. Man. Your boy been out here rough. Y'all ain't even tell me I was looking like that. But, oh man, we finna stay up out here. We finna go get some stuff done. Y'all around probably downtown and and just enjoy a nice day because I do leave tomorrow night. So, thought I was a gas light. <laughs> but man, what I further to do, I'm going to catch y'all uh, after I leave the barbershop tomorrow morning. I'm going to see y'all there. Oh, man. I got the best barber hands. I know I just told y'all I was going to come get a fresh, clean haircut. I got a little bro with me, you know what I'm saying? He and his barber ain't better than mine, I ain't going to say. You see the stars in the background, but man, it's time to get ready and get packed to hit the freaking road, y'all. We got another road trip coming, so we're going to tune back in when we leaving our for that. I ain't going to do nothing but go home, pack, and get ready. I'm such a last minute person. I haven't packed or did nothing at all. You packed yet, bro? No, I didn't. See, man, so y'all see that. Oh, man, that boy clean, ain't it? The next day, hey, they, they not, they not look, they man, Tina got me cooked. He got the hey, boys, don't say, don't <laughs> he got the boys behind me. And they go, they go, oh, yeah, he coming. Hey, I'm about, I'm about to get this cook. Oh, he coming, he coming, he coming. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Thank God. Thank God. Ah, fuck them. <laughs> Fuck them niggas! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck them niggas! <laughs> I ain't into the cap and let's keep it real. He could have held us man down, he took a deal. That's why I can't show nobody how we live I got the news from my sister, gave me chills Gang off y'all pills, fucking up parties, it's just a thrill He popped his hands and I dog itching to do a drill